the air keeps on getting accumulated in the chest and the patient will not be able to breathe himself only so in trauma surgery one thing what we we'll do first is something called primary survey where whatever is killing the patient first will be treated first so in that i will just give a simple example there is a condition called tension pneumothorax what happens is the air keeps on getting accumulated in the chest and the patient will not be able to breathe himself only so the air will be there in the chest cavity but lungs he will not be ventilating so that is going to kill the patients within some second seconds or minute so what we should do in those scenario if a doctor is able to identify it just insertion of a small needle into the chest cavity will be a life saving thing in those patients so if you know how to do it it is very easy to do just take a needle and put it into the chest and the life will be saved further than we have to put a tube and that can be done when the patient is in proper care and the person who can do it will be doing something called intercostal drainage that is icd so knowing these simple things in trauma will save the life